this. This video is going to help you with your FSA review packet for week one, day two, and question two. Now this question deals with difference in elevation. So in this one it says we have a mountain climber that is going to be at an elevation of seven, 7,000 feet above sea level. And then we're going to have a deep sea diver that is going to be 3,000 feet below sea level. So it wants us to know what the difference in elevation is. Now, when we're thinking about above and below sea level, I like to make sure that we know that above sea level is positive and below sea level is negative. So if you think if you have a mountain and it sea level, then you have this person is at 7,000 and then we have a diver that is going to be below sea level and they're going to be at 3,000. Okay, so we got to find the difference between here to here. And we know that sea level is zero. So one way to do this is you start with your 7,000. And then we are going to find the difference, which means we subtract, but we are subtracting a negative 3,000. Okay? Now we know if we have a negative next to a negative, this negative is going to reverse this negative sign. So we're basically going to turn it around because it's a different direction. So this becomes 7,000 plus 3,000 and that will give us a total of 10 thousand feet in difference. And that makes sense because it takes us 7,000 feet to get from the mountain climber to sea level and it takes us another 3,000 feet on top of that to go from sea level to where the diver's at. So just remember when you are crossing the zero you're going to go in a different direction but you still need to add to that total. So distance was 7,000 plus the 3,000 would give you 10,000. I hope this video helps. Stay tuned for more.